Come on now, y'all know the blessing will come down. You want your anointing? You, you want to be blessed? You, you want a breakthrough? Learn how to praise him. Yeah. It's easy to praise him when things are going well, but learn how to praise him in the midst of sickness, in the midst of sorrow, in the midst of problems and difficulty. Learn how to say hallelujah anyhow. Hallelujah anyhow. Say it with me. Hallelujah. Anyhow, tell God thank you. Thank you for your love. Okay. Thank you for your grace. And thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your son, Jesus. Thank you for loving me in spite of what I've done. Stand on your feet and give God praise. Say thank you. All over the place. Say thank you. Thank you for everything you did in 2010. Thank you for everything you're going to do in 2010. You can praise your way. Your breakthrough is in your mouth. All you have to do is learn to praise. Go to give him the praise in everything that you're doing. Even though things are not like you want right now, praise your way through. Pray, praise your children into what you want them to be. Praise your significant other into what you want them to be. Praise. You want to stuff on your job? Just let out a hallelujah. Hallelujah. And watch the devil. That in us, we have the power to affect change. God is in control, but He's given us dominion. He's given us delegated authority to speak to our situation. But we got to speak to it with the conviction that it must change. I am God's child. I am God's ambassador. He's given me the power. So speak to that thing. And don't throw in the towel because you don't see it happen right away. Just keep on praising God. Keep on going to bed and getting up. Going to bed and getting up. You don't have to tell anybody. People are going to say, what happened to that thing you said you're going to get? What happened to that job you said you're going to get? What happened to that promotion? What happened to that car? Just keep on going to bed and getting up. Keep on going to bed and getting up. And when it happens, you don't have to say anything. All of this is more. Also, want you to come as you make a commitment to the Lord. 